I want to do a quick demonstration of where magnetic interference comes from in multirotor aircraft. So we have a little demonstration here. I've got a power wire, a plus wire, and a negative wire. And in a second, I'm going to put about an amp through this wire. Now, this is a typical Gauss meter that you can buy. This one's from Alpha Lab. And this is the sensor. It's going to sense the magnetic field around this wire. So because we use three-axis magnetometers in our multi multirotor aircraft, they're sensing the Earth's magnetic field, which is about a half a Gauss uh, down to about 0.3 Gauss. So anything in the tenth to uh, 0.2 Gauss is, is going to cause interference and cause a, a bearing error in your craft. So here we are. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and auto zero, and I'm going to turn on the power supply so that I've got about an amp going through the wire. And you can see it jumps up to about equal the Earth's magnetic field. Now here's what you can do in your craft to minimize magnetic interference. If I take the negative wire and put it very close to the positive wire, I can reduce that magnetic interference down very, very low. You can twist these wires together. That works as well. Sometimes with a bigger gauge, it's difficult. But just by moving the wires close to each other, you can reduce the magnetic interference. You also want to keep these high current wires away from your magnetometer. But uh, just wrapping them together will, uh, will save a lot of trouble.